Hey everyone, welcome back to Games Revealed. I am James Lamas the Brink, and we are one community, like always. And I have a confession today. I'm going to be sharing with you my most abused Steam Deck accessory. The poor thing. The poor thing. I, I just feel so bad, but it's done so well for me. It's the D brand Kill Switch Protective Case. And I know this, this is not a pay, promo. All the Steam Decks in the house have this cool cover on it. So, you know, I've taken this case with me everywhere from the sunny beaches of Hawaii to the lush rainforests of Costa Rica and even the bustling cities in California, Georgia, and Nevada, Las Vegas. It's been through countless airport securities and the peace of mind it gives me is unbeatable. I can just toss my Steam Deck into the security bins without a second thought and it always comes out the other side looking as good as new. It really has been just amazing device and it's just so durable. Now what really sells me on this case is not just its durability but also its features. The built-in kickstand and the SD card holder have been game changers for me. No more fumbling around with extra accessories. Everything I need is right there on the case. I can't tell you how many times the kickstand has saved my wrists during those long game sessions on tables. My, I mean, heck, I play it even in bed and I'll set it down on my chest and just watch it, a cutscene or, or just give a little bit of a wrist twist, right? To uh, get back into the game without any cramping or just hurting of the wrists. It's been a game changer. But now let's talk about some of the other features of this case. I've done reviews on this. I've done other things that go over this case. I've covered it multiple times, and I'm back here after nearly two years. It's been a year and a half of having the original one, which whole scandal on that almost. Something I just have to talk about because it is a good case. But now some of the features, just to resell it for you guys. That's going to sound a little sales pitchy, but that's going, it's, it's meant to. I want you guys to have something good. It's thin, about as thin as a nickel, but don't let that fool you. This case offers military grade impact resistance, protecting your Steam Deck from all those accidental drops and bumps. And uh, some people have dropped it from high enough, like just from, from their chest down onto cement, and it's done just fine. I don't recommend doing that, but it helps. And when it comes to travel, this case has you covered. The travel cover is a sleek and discreet way to protect your Steam Deck when you're on the go. It's definitely a step up from Valve's OEM carrying case, like the, the original case that it comes with. I promise you, it won't embarrass you in public, I I think, unless you say it's a kill switch, and then they're like, he's saying kill over here, and you can't say that on an airplane, and then you get in trouble. And, and then at least when they detain you, you know that they throw your bag with you, or like into the Wherever it is, they, they throw stuff when they detain you, and you know it's safe. Now, I'm sure you're all wondering about the precision of this case. Well, let's just say it's like a second skin for your Steam Deck. It fits perfectly with no gaps or loose areas in the backplate mount. Provides a secure attachment for the kickstand with the promise of more potential attachments in the future. Is what they say on the marketing site, but it... I don't think there's anything. You can get 3D printed stuff for it, but I definitely think they do need to work on something for this because it's been amazing. And it definitely makes it a little bit heavier, but it's definitely worth the protection. And speaking of attachments, the universal mount is a great feature. It's perfect for attaching an external battery, a phone holder, or even a half-eaten burrito like they mentioned. But what really sets this case apart for me is the texture, those microscopic ridges you see. They provide thousands of grippy contact points making it almost impossible to drop your Steam Deck and the addition of grip stripes on the sides is the grippiest case I've ever held. And I've had a bunch of different cases that are similar to this, testing them out. This has been by far the best. You can get other ones that are much cheaper, but I will have to say, it feels premium. It just works. The stick grips are also a nice touch. They add extra grips to your thumbsticks, which is a whole kit that you get. You can get even more. And so it ensures that your thumbs won't slip no matter how intense the gaming session gets. And it can protect because over time, the sticks, the top of the sticks can wear down and the rubber pieces can fall off. So it can help protect on that. And let's not forget about the tempered glass screen protector. It's practically invisible and it's compatible with both the Etch Glass 512 gigabyte Steam Deck and Steam Deck. And you got to be Careful though, you will lose some of your anti-glare protection if you put that on there. Even though it's compatible, it won't ruin it. If you take like you take it back off, you'll have the anti-glare still. Just 
be warned though that you'll lose some of that and it's up to you if you want to put it on or not it does come with the kit i, I believe and finally i must mention the dbrand customizable skins these skins are easy to apply easier than other ones to apply <laughs> they leave no adhesive residue and come in dozens of unique designs it's the perfect way to add a personal touch to your deck so there you have it the dbrand kill switch protective case it's thin protective and packed with features it's the perfect companion for any steam deck owner and you will whether or not you're traveling from one room in your house or across the the world this just makes the Steam Deck almost the perfect device. You pair these together, you can go about anywhere with them. And the Ally does have one for it. Dbrand has one for the Asus ROG Ally, just not for the Ally X yet, but hopefully they do. I hope that Dbrand makes these cases for all the devices that are coming out that I am interested in, which the Ally X is one of them. And it will make it so that I won't be for sure able to take it wherever I go. I have kids, I have a dog, I have to travel more and more for work, and I have had my kids break phones. I've had, I've even dropped my phone onto carpet and it had a protective case and it broke the back of it, but it wasn't a kill switch case or like a dbrand case. It was just a regular case. And so far I have started being not abusive, let's, but a little abusive. It is my most abused accessory but I've started doing a little bit more riskier things with it and everything's good. The case doesn't scratch too much. I, it, you, you can see it right here. It's right here. Like it, it looks good. This is just tight enough to where if you do drop it, it won't pop off. It clips in well, and you can see my, don't mind my screen being smudged a little bit. You can see that it just, it just feels good. Like at first, I think the, the like the micro texture on these like, that helps with the grip was a little annoying because it kind of feels like sandpaper at times a little bit or like feels like fingerprints. And I just was a little turned off at first, but after using it for a little bit, I, I wouldn't go without. Definitely helps prevent from slips and falls and all that. So that is pretty much it. This is kind of like a, after a year and a half of using these kill switches, I know I fanboyed about this thing. I'm a huge fan of this device. I think the premiumness is worth it. I definitely think there's a lot to this case that is just, it, it does this job so well that you don't notice it sometimes. And so people might not think it's as important as it really is. I still pair it with some carrying bags and all that, but I don't have to use any bulky carrying cases that protect it right where if i pull it out i might slip and, and it will fall and break this is just a very easy way to protect it in just a day-to-day -day. it's just I, I don't remove it honestly it's been a little hard because skins and doing extra things to it is a little harder as you can see right here i have my steam deck where i you know oh, it's really dusty don't mind that it has the whole shell replacement on it and it definitely it, it comes out with the kill switch looking good it does look good with this but it still is a little bit of a shame to cover up so much with the kill switch but i wouldn't have it any other way i just i feel so much safer with that thing on so this is the video let me know in the comments below do you like the kill switch do you like having nothing do you like having protection you probably should always have protection kids and check out the description below for all the goodies that help promote, help the channel grow, and all that stuff. So thank you for watching. Catch you guys next time. Peace out. Later.